Hello and welcome to Home Cooking Spain. Today I'm going to be cooking chicken breasts and mushrooms. So let's begin. So we'll start off by turning the stove on. I'm going to turn it up to medium high and I'm just going to add a couple of tablespoons of olive oil and we'll wait for that to heat up before adding the two boneless and skinless chicken breasts and my mushrooms I've already sliced them up here and today's dinner I'm going to be accompanying it with some plain white rice so let's wait for this to heat up well so once the oil is nice and hot I'm going to add the chicken breasts here and we're going to brown them all round. Let's hope it doesn't splash too much. Okay, so once the chicken is browned all round, this doesn't have to be toasted. I'll take it out and leave it aside on the plate. This is well jumpy. Well, and in this same oil, I'm going to add another couple of tablespoons and I'll chuck in the mushrooms and I'll stir fry these for about five minutes, turning them around every couple of minutes or so. So after five minutes, the mushrooms are done. So what I'll do next is I'm going to add the chicken back in. And any juice that's on the plate. I'm not going to add any salt yet. I maybe I don't even need to because the chicken broth usually has enough salt. But what I'll do is add a teaspoon of paprika some black pepper and a glass of white wine. And I'm just going to turn these over. And we'll leave that there to boil for five minutes until the wine, the alcohol from the wine evaporates. And let's cover it up. Well, so once the five minutes are over, the alcohol has evaporated. I'll move this over again. Smelling delicious, by the way. Really good. So the next step will be to add the chicken broth. I'm going to add about half a litre, which should be just enough to cover the chicken. A bit more. Yeah, that's half a litre. I'll, I'm going to bring this to the boil now. So I'm going to turn it right up on full heat just so that it starts bubbling. And I'll do a salt chick just in case. So let's wait for this to start boiling. Okay, so this is starting to boil, so let's do a salt check. Perfect, no salt needed. I should have known. If you need salt, just add it in now. So the next step, I'm going to turn this back down to number 7, medium high. I'm going to cover it up, and I'm going to leave it there 
for um, 20 minutes. Right, so the 20 minutes are over. So let's have a look at this. The sauce is starting to thicken up a bit. Let's turn these over. So I'll cover it back up again and leave it there for 15 minutes and if you're going to be having rice now is a good time to start doing it because by the time that this is ready the rice, rice will be ready so you can eat everything nice and hot so I'll be back in 15 minutes right so time's up and this is ready lovely jubbly so let's turn the stove off and I'll just let it stop bubbling and then I'll serve it here for show. Well, so here is today's delicious lunch ready. I hope that you enjoyed today's recipe video. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.